back. Um, today I have a 20 minute workout for you. So um, maybe you're short on time or something like that. This is the workout for you. We're gonna focus on strength. So we're gonna do a lower body exercise, an upper body exercise, and then pair them together for a compound exercise. Um, no cardio at all today. So again, this one is focusing on total body strength. Only 20 minutes. I'm gonna turn up the music, and then we're gonna get started. Let's inhale those arms up. Right here, exhale all the way down. Right here, inhale up. Exhale down. One more time, inhale all the way up. Let's forward fold. Exhale all the way down. Round it up. One for arm to bear at a time. Roll those shoulders back. Inhale up. Reach up to the ceiling. Exhale forward fold. Round it up. One for arm at a time. Roll those shoulders back. Inhale up. Then we'll walk it out into a high plank. Walk those hands out. Right here. Very good. Bring that right leg forward. Right here. Send those hips forward. This should feel really good. Let's alternate. Try and get that heel all the way up to the, that hand. Let's switch. How are we feeling today? Pretty good? We're going to knock off this workout. And I promise you, you'll feel better after. All right, let's hold it back on that right side. Right here, hold it here. Inhale that arm up. Right here, hold it. Exhale down, let's switch sides. Inhale up, reach that left arm up to the ceiling. Hips are forward. Exhale down. Send both legs back, downward facing dog. Right here, lift those hips up. Kind of love the knees and ankles. Right here. Squat down, stand up. Okay, this is our last one right here. 
right here. Very good. Pick up those weights. Hammer curl. So bicep curl, those uh, palms are facing out. Hammer curl, they're facing in. Right here. One at a time. Keep those elbows tucked in. Those shoulders are down and relaxed. The core is tight. And those knees are nice and soft. We never want to lock out those knees. Right here. Yep. We have 10 on each side for this one. Again, I hope you have the heavier set of weights right now. Working on those biceps. We have one more on each arm, right here. Up. Yeah, very good, set them down. Back to sumo squats. Point those toes. Down and up for 10. Here we go. Right here. Down and up. Squeeze on your way up. Make sure you can wiggle those toes right now. That chest is nice and tall. We have two more. Right here. Stand it up, very good. Grab the weights again. Hammer curl. Roll those shoulders back. Elbows are in. Left, right. Good. Left, right. Left, right here. Good. Up, up. Core strong. Yep. Curl up. Curl. Curl. Yeah. Yeah. Right here. Two more on each. One. Here's two. Okay, this time we're gonna hold those weights right here. As we squat down, then we're gonna come up, curl both arms together this time. Here we go for 10. Right here, curl up. Yeah, right here, curl up. Squat down, curl up. Right here. Those knees are working out. Core is still nice and strong. Elbows are tucked. Compound exercise right here. Working more than just one muscle group. Good, two more. Right here, curl, last one, squat down, curl up. Very nice, grab yourself some water. I'm gonna go ahead and explain the next group we have. Done with those, okay. Again, grab your heavier set of dumbbells, going into an RDL, and then a row. We all know what an RDL looks like, it's right here. Nice and close, palms are in. Follow those weights down your legs. Set the hips back. Okay, we have a nice flat back. Then we're gonna row, looks like this. Row, palms are still down, facing in. Okay, then we're gonna RDL, row, stand up. RDL, row, stand up. So that's our compound exercise. Starting with that RDL. For 10, I'm gonna turn sideways. Here we go. Stand up. Stand up. Tuck that chin. Make sure you have a nice flat back. Working on the hamstrings. Right here. Right here. We have three. Two more. Right here. Last one. Good, okay. Let's hinge at the waist. We still have a nice flat back. Palms are still in. We're gonna roll up. Elbows are nice and high, nice and close to that rib cage. Right here for 10. Squeeze at the top. Squeeze those shoulder blades together. Right here. Right here. Exhale up. Exhale up. Three more. Yep, two, last one. Very good, stand it all the way up. Okay, back to the RDL, right here. Send the hips back, feet are about hip distance apart. Roll those shoulders back, back is flat. Here we go. Squeeze up, squeeze up, squeeze up, squeeze. That's five, we have five left. Right here. Last two. Up. Good 
job. How does that feel? Feel it in the back side of the legs? That's where you should feel it. All right, back to the row. Then we're gonna put it together, right here. Hinge at the waist, palms are down, facing in. Right here, 10. Squeeze at the top. Yeah. Squeeze. 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 Right here. Four more. Up. Three. Two more. Last one, very good. Okay, shake it out. I'll give you a little break, then we're gonna do it together. So again, looks like this. RDL, row, stand it up. Okay, we have 10 of those. Let's combine it, here we go. Nice flat back, core is strong. Right here, right here, row. Then stand it up, there's one. Row, stand it up. Row, stand it up. Nice and slow and controlled with this one. This entire workout is trying to gain a strength, right? Nothing is super fast. We want everything controlled. Focusing on four. Let's do three more. Up. Yep. Two. Last one right here. Stand it up. Very good. Shake it out. Shake out those legs. Grab some water. Next time we're gonna use this step, right here. A couple important things when we use the step. When you step up, I want you to make sure that that heel is all the way up on that step. So if we're not stepping up right here, make sure that entire foot is all the way up. Two different variations here. You can either step up, plant both legs, and then step back down. Right here, it look like this. Step up, step back down. Higher intensity or a little more challenging right here. Then bring the left one up, back down. Okay, so we're engaging the core and we're using our balance to help. You, you're using your core to help the balance. It looks like this. Drive that knee up, back down. Drive that knee up, then back down, okay? Then we're going to take probably the lighter of the dumbbells if you have two sets. If you don't, don't worry about it. You can always decrease the reps. And we're going all the way around our head, okay? Starting with that step. Let's go on the right side first, then we'll work the left side. It's right here. Drive it up. Yes. Drive it up. So I'm working just that right leg right now. Planting it. Then bring that left knee up. Core is strong. Again, nice and slow and controlled with this one. Keep that core strong and those shoulders down. 
So make sure those shoulders aren't working up to those ears. You might try and shrug up. Keep them down. Nice and relaxed. You're almost there. We have three left. Here's two. Now we're going back to the step ups. Set that weight down. Back to the step ups. Let's start with that right leg again. Right here. Right leg up. Draw that knee up. Back down. Right knee.
Very good. Step it down. Give yourselves a hand. Very nice job with that exercise. Go ahead and get some water. I'm going to explain the last one. We have a regular squat. Okay, grab yourself some water. Done with that, we have one more set. It's squats and a shoulder complex. So regular body weight squats right here. And then we're gonna go forward for 10, up and over for 10, and then straight arm raises right here, all the way up. So if you have a lighter set of dumbbells ready, go ahead and grab just one of those. We need that for this complex right here. Down and up for 10 body weight squats right here. Down and up. Then we'll put it together at the end, and then we'll pull it down. Right here. Five left. Yep. Three more. Last two. Up. Last one right here. Down and up. Good. Grab that weight. Just one of them right here. Straight out in front of you. Hold it right in front of that chest. Ten. Right here. Nine. Okay, so as I press out, my arms aren't locking. Just fully extend without locking. So those elbows are still nice and soft. Knees are soft. Relax those shoulders down. We have three. Here's two. Right here, up and over. Press. Right here, press. For 10. Yep. Seven. Six. Five more. Here's three. Two left. Press up. Very good, straight arms, all the way up. Nice and slow and controlled on the way down. All the way up, I don't want your body rocking, okay? So it doesn't look like this. I want you nice and slow on that way, on the way down. Nice straight arms, core is strong. All the way down. We have five left of these. Right here, burn out those shoulders. You can do this, up, all the way down. Yep, up. Back down. Almost there, right here, last one. All the way up. Press up. Back down. Very good, drop that weight. Back to body weight squats, we have 10. Right here, down and up. You can do this. Talk yourself into it. Give yourself these 20 minutes. Focus on you, right here. Down and up. Down and up. We have five. Here's four. Three more. Last two. Last one right here. Okay, grab that weight. Back to that shoulder complex. Straight forward right here. Here we go. Ten. Nine. Yep. Eight. Exhale. Exhale. Five more. Four. Three, two more. Yep, right here, up and over. Press, press, press. Up and over. Press. Yep, you got it. Almost there. Two more. Press. Burn those shoulders out. Last one, right here. Up. Nice and slow. can do this. You're almost done. Give it your all this last little bit. Hang with me right here. Press up. Think about the results. Think about how good you're going to feel after this, right? I want you to work hard. Keep showing up for yourself. Last one right here. All the way down and up. Good. Relax it. Okay, we're gonna hold that weight. Down and up for 10, straight forward. Looks like this, okay? Here's 10, here we go. Yep, press forward. Nine, you can do it. Eight, we're close. Seven, nice deep squat. Six, right here. Five, almost there, four, give me three. Last two, right here. Last one. Very good, bring it in. Step it out, shake it out. Give yourselves a hand, grab some water.
cool it down right away. Get you out of here. Right leg is forward. Left one is back. Lean into it. Hold it here. Start to bring that heart rate down. Slow the breathing down. Try that heel up. Tuck the hips. Drop the knee. Hold it here. Send those hips forward. Let's switch sides. Right leg is forward, left one is back. I'm sorry, left leg is forward, right one is back. Drive that heel down. Lean into that front knee. Let's draw that heel up. Tilt those hips. Drop the knee. Hold it here. I hope you're feeling strong, empowered. Got a good little sweat going. We're almost done. Good. Walk it all the way forward. Take those legs out nice and wide. Over to the left. Hold it here. Back up to the center. Over to the right. So again, this is just a trial for us. We want to see what kind of workouts you're interested in doing. We really care about you. We're trying to get you through this little four-week shutdown. Staying healthy. Left hand is down. Right arm is up and over. So feel free to email us, comment, something like that um, to help us know what kind of workouts you want to do. Exhale down, let's switch sides. Left one is up and over, hold it here. Exhale, release that. Take that hand, grab that wrist, send everything forward, tuck the chin into your chest, all the way up to the ceiling. Reach it up. Exhale all the way down. Nice three nice deep inhales. Reach those arms up. Exhale down. Again, inhale up. Reach them up. Exhale down. Last one right here. Inhale all the way up. Give yourselves a great big hand. Nicely done. We will see you next.